Now we're going to go over how to send emojis, stickers, or GIFs um, using the Gboard keyboard. So once you have the keyboard pulled up, you want to go ahead and hit the emojis button down here. And you see you get your options down here of emojis, stickers, GIFs, and then even what looks like the old fashioned typed out emojis, I guess is what you could call them. So we'll go ahead and start with the emojis here and you can search for emojis here at the top. We have our most recent ones here. We have faces, we can kind of scroll through and pick. Um, we have people and a bunch of different options that's kind of organized here. Or you can just go ahead and swipe through all the different options and go ahead and just type on what you want to send and then just hit send. Um, and your keyboard will go back to normal and you'll see they sent. But also in here, if you go to the people, um, you could see they have a little arrow. So any emoji with this little arrow in the bottom right hand corner, you can actually go ahead and tap and hold on it. And you can see you get a bunch of different options here. So any emojis that kind of have those arrows on them, you can go ahead and select the different options if you want. Okay, um, and then you still have your delete key here down at the bottom. So that's emojis, but if we want to send stickers is our next option here. You can see you have your sticker pack options here at the top. Those are the ones you are already have, and you can click on a sticker and send it, and it'll send. Or if you wanna add more sticker packs, you can go ahead and click the add button here. Once you do that, you will see other sticker packs that you can go ahead and you can just click add and then they'll pop up here at the top. And you can see like these are kind of animated ones. So you can go ahead and send these as well. And they'll pop up there. You can also on stickers if you click the settings gear on the right at the top here. You can go ahead and rearrange the order that they'll show up in. So if we like move these around and go back, you'll see now it's rearranged the order at the top here. Now, if you want to do GIFs, you can tap on here and you actually get a bunch of different options here at the top for different categories. Um, go back but you also get a search button and you can search kind of anything you want and you'll see you get a couple different options here so if we select one it will send um, if we're texting someone or wherever we feel like we want to use these options and then the last one is very simple it's kind of the old-fashioned ones if you don't want to type them out and they'll send like so so again, if you click the emoji key, you can go ahead and pull these up. But also, if you just click on the arrow up here, you'll also see you get stickers and GIFs. And again, if you go to the three dots here, you can go ahead and add more things um, and rearrange those things if you want to. Um, but that's another way to get to GIFs and stickers. But again, if you want emojis, you go down here. If you're not seeing this emojis button, for some reason, you can go ahead and turn that on in settings. So to get to our settings, we just tap and hold on the comma key. And then we have our settings already selected. So we'll just let go. Once here, we'll go to preferences and you'll hit show emoji key switch. Um, and if you turn that on, that emoji key will then be there. If you turn it off, it'll go away. Turn it on, it'll be there. Um, so that's how you go and send emojis, GIFs, or stickers um, using the Gboard app. Hopefully that helps.